Hello, hello, welcome, hi. Um, gonna start out with a shout out today. Um, welcome to Colorado Martini, who found me on Twitter and apparently likes me on Twitter that she just decided to poke around my YouTube and then left me a lovely message on the um, previous vlog. Um, I have checked out her channel and it looks like she does like a lot of um, lifestyle um, videos, help recipes, cocktails, which look like they're mostly um, alcohol free cocktails. What, what's that? But hey, you know, um, no, it looks like it looks good. If you, I've only watched one video so far, which is um, her goat yoga video. I haven't had a chance to watch the other one, some of them are a little bit longer. Um, but definitely something I'm gonna have a closer look at. She seems like she seems to have a very sort of big um, personality, um, very joyful in her video. Um, and hey, a, a, a video with baby goats. So if nothing else, check that one out. Um, I'll uh, I'll put a, a link to her. Um, yeah, I'll put a link to her channel down below. So um, hi, thank you, um, appreciate it. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll check out some more of the videos. Um, and hey, uh, thanks thanks for the um, sub. I appreciate it. Um, that being said, I'm sorry if you can hear that outside. I've already closed the windows in here, but there's an alarm going off. But it's it's getting late, and I need to. Well, not late, late, but I want to get the video out of the way. I want to make my dinner. I just want to chill out and watch some cartoons or something. I don't know. I'd... It's like those things. Oh, I do. I still haven't watched Logan, um, but because himself. He's up. He's been off the last couple of nights, uh, which is fine. Uh, but it does mean that you know, like, I want to watch something. I like to get it all finished out of the way because we'll be coming in and we want to chat. Which yeah, it's fine. But then you like you're halfway through an action sequence and someone's coming in and telling you about their day. It's like so. I like to time things so that they're finished before you know I have to pause and do anything else. Um, but that's also why I want to get the video done now. As opposed to waiting for the alarm, because it stopped for a couple of minutes and it started again. It, it happens. Someone will, someone will deal with it. But in the meanwhile, um, yeah. So it didn't work today. Didn't get didn't get a call in the morning, which is somewhat annoying. Under my hair, so it's, it's, I like it when it's. I think I like it when it's loose. I, I get it up out of the way when it's um, I'm doing stuff or eating, but otherwise that's that's better. Um. But I've tied up my um, my comic book section. Um, you can't see there, but it looks a lot nicer. And I've, I've tied up another corner in a thing where it was getting a lot. Where all my um, goodie boxes, like the, oh, there we go. Oh, so much better. All my um, goodies from my uh, unboxings, the the ones I I aren't you know the ones that aren't t-shirts or, or practical ones that I'm, I'm using or displaying somehow. Um, are all, all in safe storage until I can work out what to do with them. Like I've got like a big pile of prints that I really like, but I don't really have any room to put them on. You can see the um, yeah, there we go. Comics looking a lot tidier. And then the, yeah, that that pile there, the white boxes there, here. Ignore the book. That's just um, himself uh, war book. But this pile here, that was a lot lot scruffier earlier. So I've been productive in my day off. Um, I still got a big pile of stuff to sort out, but I guess I'll have to wait till tomorrow. Oh, actually, did I see? Did I show you? Ah, these. I got. I got these. Um, they, there's a the pound local pound store is is closing out, and um, yeah, there's 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 bottoms for it. Uh, so you stick the bottom in, and uh, yeah, you got a little box, twenty five by twenty five centimeters. Sorry, cubed. Um, so yeah, I've been. I'm reorganising some of my stuff that's kind of piled up um, into into these. Got three, well, originally three for six pound, which still isn't too bad. But I got them on sale for three pounds, so yay, pound each. Not too bad. I'm getting warm. Um, so yeah, that's that's my day of just sort of tidying and sorting and, and chilling and heartburn. Why have I got heartburn? But uh, anyway. We got a book, we have questions, let's see what today is. Da -da -da. Ooh, what's the best advice you've ever given? I 
don't know. Um, I've... I guess people have sort of come up to me and said, oh, that was good advice, thank you for that, or, oh, thanks for your help. I mean, it depends on what you talk about. In, in my previous life, you know, I was um, <clears throat> working at the uh, entertainment store. I've probably given people advice on their purchases, like, you know, buying games, you know, if it's especially for a specific age group. Um, I, I give directions, which is a kind of advice. Um, I mean, there's there's the general sort of platitude of be excellent to each other and you know take you know be be nice. I, if I know, I don't know if this is patronising or not, but it's still it's something that makes me feel better. If I know someone's driving, I will say it's like drive safe, um, stuff like that. Which again isn't really that's probably not good advice. That's just sensible. That's just probably what they're doing anyway. They didn't even need to say it. Um. Uh, eat your vegetables. <laughs> I know. I mean, I, 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 I can't think that anyone's ever come up to me and said, "Oh, that thing you told me before." I mean, himself. We obviously have lots of deep discussions about life, the universe, and what is going on in his world and I have given advice I've, I've said well here's what I think um same with Aaron you know when he's he's got a problem he wants to talk out uh, I'm more than happy to listen and and I I give advice where I can where I think it's appropriate I'm not sure um himself you you give me more direct feedback I'm not saying that Aaron that I haven't helped Aaron it's just that you know, he doesn't always turn around and say, oh, that was, that was amazing advice, thank you, that, that, that solved all my problems. Probably because, not that I haven't been able to help solve the problem, necessarily. I'm sure there have been a few times when it has helped, but my, my advice probably wasn't the only thing that, you know, or he, he talked to a couple of other people uh, and they basically said the same thing. So it's not that, not that it necessarily didn't help, it's just that it didn't help exclusively. Um, or the problems, you know, so big that it's still ongoing because life can be that way sometimes, you know, you can say well you could try this but if sometimes the advice is well why don't you wait a while and see what happens you could still be in that while um, so I've not had anyone that I can think of come up to me and say oh my god that advice you gave me was just perfect, exactly what I needed I mean yeah, people, I have had customers come back to me and say, oh yeah, that was really good. Thank you for the that the game or film recommendations. I really appreciated that. Um, you know, people do thank me for giving them directions. Um, I've actually had people I walk past again. Um, like, oh yeah, we found it. Awesome, thank you. Again, I don't know. If giving directions is really advice. Um, I like to think that I have. Like I said, you know, I'm probably. Maybe I've just said stuff, uh, you know, and, and sort of given my point of view on how the, the situation, how I see it, and that has led to a greater solution, but maybe they wouldn't necessarily consider it advice in the moment. Um, you know, uh, be nice to each other is the best thing I can say, which is, sounds really spongy, but honestly it's something I can sincerely believe. You know, just, just chill the F out, people. You know, we're on this little rock together, you might, might as well try and get along. Uh, I don't know. Hug more. Unless, you know, the person doesn't want to be hugged. You know, you should always check for boundaries. But if it's cool, hug more. I love hugging me. I love hugging me. <laughs> um, you know, and, and so what if this is supposed to be for children? It's cute! Yeah, that's the best piece. I know that the best piece of advice I have given, the best piece of advice I can give is you enjoy it, enjoy it! You know, you do you, you be yourself. Don't let other people criticise you. There's nothing wrong with. Unless. And obviously, the ponies aren't anything to do is. Unless you're going out and maiming or hurting something, then the best advice I can give for you is to stop doing that because that's really mean and. 
antisocial and just horrible. Um, but otherwise, the best advice I can give is one, enjoy what you enjoy without, you know, feeling criticised or pressured, you know, weird pressure about, for it. And two, if you're one of the people criticising, shut up! They're enjoying it, they're not hurting anyone. They're not hurting you, they're not hurting themselves, they're not hurting anybody else in the environment. They're enjoying what they're enjoying and they're sitting quietly and doing so. So yeah, best advice I can give, you do you and don't criticise anyone else for being you and, and be nice to each other. There you go. Oh, so. Still haven't really fixed it. Still haven't really ruined it properly. But you can follow me and find people and, and see what um, Colorado Martini liked so much. I don't know. But she did. So again, thank you. Um, yeah. Uh, thanks for watching. Be awesome to each other. I've been Michelle, you've been listening, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye!